Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. Hope everyone is well. Well, since I couldn't get to it before I had to go to the bread and butter job today, I better get it done before I go to bed tonight. It's time for the weekend top and bottom of the deck, guys. I apologize, it's going to be about 12 hours late for most of you, but we'll get it to you. Anywho, it's Aquarius, uh, Aquarius. It's Aquarius season, so we're going to start with the air signs and go around the wheel that way. For those of you who are new here and don't know how we do this, I do go by the elements for the top and bottom of the deck readings, just because it makes for a little bit of a shorter reading and I'm not sitting here putting people to sleep. So, that being said, if it resonates with your sun sign, cool, it's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate with your sun sign, you can check your moon rising or Venus sign readings. If you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better, just keep in mind time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. I might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And our dear friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here at the fire sign table. Thanks. I appreciate you coming by. I appreciate everybody coming by. So, if you're not sure where your sun sign falls as far as the elements go, I do shout the signs out as I go along. And there's usually someone kind enough to time stamp the readings for me once they're posted because I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. I, this is my part-time job here at Fire Sign Tarot. I, I have a 50-hour week bread and butter job and I have a family and a house to try to manage and it's just, I, I think, I spread myself a little thin sometimes. Anywho... Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels. I ask that you join us this evening as we throw down the cards for the weekend top and bottom of the deck. Thank you, Source. Thank you, Spirit. Okay. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I had to stop and think for a second. Oh, gosh. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What's the date? January 23rd and 24th, 2021. Oh, boom, 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 boom. Strength reversed, two of wands reversed. Air signs, are you holding back from moving on from something? <clears throat> What's up with that? <sighs> what happened? Six of Wands upright, it is sort of reversed. You bounce back from something, okay? Bounce back. Put it out of your head and it's not, con it wasn't consuming you. Okay, what happened after that? The moon and the four of wands. False stability? Things appeared to be stable, but I don't think they were. I mean, not truly. Okay, what's coming in for this weekend? Because super weird energy so far, air signs. Seven wands upright, knight of cups upright. So what are you holding back from?
you've been withholding forward move, and I think this weekend you're going to probably go at it with some inner demons one more time, possibly get up. I'm not catching courage, though. We'll throw a clarifier on it. There's an offer coming in. Either an offer's coming in or you're getting ready to make one, but something's holding you back. Hmm. All right. I'll bite. <clears throat> Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, can I ask for some clarity for my air sign friends, please? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 23rd and 24th, 2021. All right. Why the strength reversed and the two of wands reversed? What? What's got you holding back? Seven of Swords. Secrets. Secrets, the Seven of Swords, the Moon. False sense of stability. Hmm. Okay. I'm not going to beat that dead horse. If it's resonating, let me know. Why is the Six of Wands here? Ace of Wands. You picked up, you dusted off. Victory after the battle. New start. New fiery, passionate start with something. Okay. Why the Eight of Swords reversed? King of Swords reversed. Oh, okay. So. I'm hearing, forget this. Not giving it a second thought. Possibly having a little bit of a bad attitude toward the situation. I can see that if it's all Seven of Swords. I mean, yeah. Okay. Why the moon? Why the moon? Sun reversed. Too many unknowns. The connections there not equally felt. I don't know. Maybe. False happiness, false stability. Why the Four of Wands? Ten of Wands reversed, unable to release the burden, unable to close the cycle. Something to get off your chest. Possibly oh, sending inner demons. Did you leave something unfinished? Somebody left something unfinished. I think it's somebody's secrets and crap got in the way and that's why you weren't able to move on. You're holding yourself back from moving on. Possibly some of you can't release the burden because you're still a little bit angry.
open, the door's open, but you won't walk through it. The door's open, but you won't walk through it. I mean, I wouldn't want to walk through the door if it's all seven of swords and secrets and stuff. Huh. Okay, why the seven of wands for what's coming in this weekend? wands upright. I don't think you're holding back anymore. <clears throat> I think you're finally going to let go. That's pretty cool. Right on. You're going to let go of that wand. You're going to move forward. You're going to defeat whatever inner insecurities you got going on. Why the Knight of Cups? Queen of Cups. You're opening up to give and receive love. I like it. You're no longer going to allow the secrets and the BS of the past to hold you back. I like it. Nice. Advice. The world. The Nine of Wands. The only one with the power to end this cycle is you. You hold the last wand. That's, this is the eight wands of forward movement and, and the one wand of passion that you're holding. It's that last little push. But in order to get that last little push, you have to close the cycle. Okay. The Four of Cups and the Page of Swords. I like it. I like it. Think real hard. This is telling me you really need to know what's in the cup that's about to be handed to you. <laughs> if you're about to receive a cup, some of you are probably about to receive a cup. You're either about to receive it or you're about to give it. If you're about to receive it, know what's in the cup. Have the honest conversations. Contemplate it. Don't go in hastily is what I'm feeling about that because... Sometimes haste just leads to those seven of swords moments and y'all don't want that. So that's my take on it, air signs. Clean up my stuff here. Okay. Real simple, short, sweet, and to the point tonight, guys. I got to get up early in the morning. <laughs> It's, as I'm reading this, about 12.45 in the morning on Saturday morning, so <laughs> I have to be out the door by 7.45 in the morning, so I'm not probably not going to get a whole lot of sleep tonight. That's okay. I don't sleep a lot on the weekends anyway, so okay. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Heavenly Father, Mother, Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, I ask for the messages you have for Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 23rd and 24th, 2021. Thank you, Source. Thank you, Spirit. Spirit. 
Six of Swords reverse, Ten of Wands in the upright. Oh, well. Tis the season, I guess. Are you in, like, return mode? Thinking about going back to get something off your chest, maybe? To release a burden? That's what I'm getting out of that. Hmm. What happened? Four of Pentacles upright and Nine of Pentacles reversed. A little needy. Either the person you were dealing with or you. Somebody was a little needy. Held someone a little bit too close. Needed someone a little bit too much. Is it you or them? What happened after that? Five of Swords in the reverse, Two of Cups in the reverse. Oh, that went all over, didn't it? That tells me something blew up and there was a disconnect. Not like five of wands blew up, but you're not picking up the pieces of that anytime soon. Or at least in the moment when it happened, that's what it was like. Not picking up the pieces of that anytime soon. Everything's still scattered and obviously you're in separation. That's where the Six of Swords, the return, comes in. It's coming in this weekend. Oh. Five of Wands, Page of Swords reversed. Well, nobody panic. Nobody panic. Confrontation and a cutoff in communication. Well, okay. Cut off or a block. Hmm. Well, all I can say to what I'm seeing so far is, well, you can extend the olive branch all day long, but it's not up to you whether they choose to take it, if you're the one extending the olive branch. That's not your part of the journey. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity on the cards and the table? For my water sign friends, please. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 23rd, 24th, 2021. 2021. 2021. I almost said 2024 for some reason. Whoa! I don't think we need to clarify that. I'm just going to jump right down to, you know what? I'm going to go right, right down to here because all this pretty much spoke for itself, didn't it? Why the five of wands? Stop moving. Ace of Pentacles. It's a pretty small olive branch. One more. Oh, hi. Hi, Priestess reversed. I think possibly the person you're dealing with might have a little bit of an ego problem. A little bit. A little bit. Like, um... Why do you come why do you come to me with such a small offer? Okay. Now I'm gonna have to clarify what's up top because now I'm super confused. Why the confrontation? Nine of Cups.
I think you're just going to be happy to get it off your chest. And there again, um, it's not your responsibility or your, it's not your journey if they take the olive branch or not. I'm thinking maybe they were the needy ones. I don't know. Okay. Back up. Why the four of pentacles upright, nine of pentacles reversed? Just one card. Just one card. Oh, well, the tower came out, so, okay. <laughs> somebody got a little clingy, somebody got a little needy. Don't know if it was you or them. Somebody held on a little too tight. I think it all kind of busted apart, hence the, it's all scattered. We're not picking up these pieces anytime soon. One on the five of swords reverse, two of cups reverse, just one, just one. Just thank you, Queen of Pentacles. <clears throat> I think you found your independence. Okay, so you'll be satisfied with just extending the olive branch if you're the one extending the olive branch. Why the page of swords reverse then? Okay. Why the four reversed? Knight of Cups. Well, the universe never shuts one door completely without opening another, does it? You could have something else coming in, water sign friends. Okay. That little bit of communication is going to be cut off, and that's not going to go anywhere. Well, maybe this one will. Hmm. One on the Knight of Cups. Well, we'll get some advice. Hi. Queen of Cups reversed. Moving on. Yep, you are going to just kind of emotionally close yourself off to this. Not even have it as an option and move on. I like it. You can't control if somebody takes an olive branch or not. You just can't. Advice. Nine of Wands in the reverse. High Priestess. Sometimes you just got to throw in the towel. Sometimes you just got to throw in the towel and you have to allow yourself to be led and guided in a new direction. You have to follow your intuition on some things. Listen to your guides. They're there to help you. Temperance in the reverse. Shadow side in the reverse. If there's negative energy between y'all, 
and there's bad blood and we're okay, it may be just time to disconnect from that. Get off your chest what you need to get off your chest and then move on. As Granny always said, if it's meant to be, it'll be. If it's not, it won't. Solid, sound grandma advice right there. Miss Grandma. If grandma was still alive, she would turn a hundred this spring. <laughs> I know, right? And it'll be ten years this summer that she's been gone, so she lived to the ripe old age of ninety. Anyway, enough about my grandma. All right, fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. All right, get back in your deck. There. Oh, I'm getting all cluster cussed here. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for my fire sign friends tonight. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 23rd and 24th, 2021. Thank you, Source. Thank you, Spirit. Fire signs. The Hermit. The Empress. Wow. That's not too shabby, guys. <sighs> Going through a period of healing, possibly some introspection. Finding your worth. Deciding what's worth putting your energy into. Possibly birthing something new. Okay. Could be a Virgo or a Gemini you're dealing with. What happened? Judgment. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Made a judgment call. Either you or the person you're dealing with. Somebody decided not to put their work... Sorry. Someone decided not to put work or effort into anything. No energy into anything. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Judgment. It's a ten. Well, it's card number 20, but it's divisible by 10, so it's allowing something to die so something new can resurrect. Okay. Alright. Happened after that. Fast forward a little bit. Ace of Wands reversed, Three of Swords reversed. Some of you possibly decided not to take a new opportunity or a new option. Not to go forth with a fiery, passionate new start with something because you're still nursing a broken heart. Not quite out of that yet. Coming out of it, but not quite. Okay, what's coming in this weekend? Four of Pentacles reverse, Two of Pentacles. Oh, sorry. Four of Pentacles upright, Two of Pentacles upright. Still holding on to something. Not quite ready to let something go. Change. This is the hard part. She is riding it was really cool bicycles over some really, really rocky waters there. 
You see that? Steampunk deck, by the way. Crossing the waters this weekend. Now I'm curious. I'm drinking water, by the way. <clears throat> I'm on a water kick. I can't drink pop anymore, so. Okay. Heavenly Father, Mother of Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, can I get some clarity on the cards on the table for my fireside friends, please? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 23rd, 24th. Cards on the table for my fire sign friends, please. Three of Pentacles. Foundation. Okay. <coughs> so the foundation's being laid for something new. Something's coming together after a long time introspection, long path to healing. Why the Ace of Swords reversed? Sorry, why the Ace of Wands reversed? Three of Cups. Why the Three of Cups? Ace of Cups. Well, okay. I'm hearing decided to just be friends. Concentrated on yourself. Concentrated on your healing. Filled your own cup for a while. Why the three of swords reversed? Allowing change. Why death? Page of Wands reversed. Queen of Swords. Truth. Cut off in communication, possibly with a fire sign. Upside down wand, upside down wand. Sword of truth, the sword of honesty. She, that queen of wands, she uses that sword to cut things out of her life.
you worked on you and you just kind of cut everything else out. Okay, this weekend, why the Four of Pentacles? What's happened with that thing you're still holding on to? Whoa, hi. Ten of Wands. You're going to release that thing you're still holding on to. Okay. By the Ten of Wands. The Hermit. Because you've healed. Wow, well, fire signs. There it is. You're releasing that thing that you've not been able to let go of. Because it's part of the process. You've thought about this for a while. You're working through the pain. You're healing. Why the Two of Pentacles? Not a cops. Why the Knight of Cups? Ten of Swords. Fire signs. You're finally ready. Congratulations. I'm happy for you. The worst of it's over. You're releasing. You're letting go. You're allowing the sun to shine again. You're going through that last little bit. You're, you're, mm, you're crossing the rocky river. You're going for a cup. I don't know if you're giving it or taking it, but it doesn't matter. You're going, you're going for the cup. I like it. I like it. You're ready for whoever this is for. Congratulations. Let's get some advice. Five of Swords upright, four reversed. Wow, okay, that's helpful. <sighs> know exactly what is going on before you jump. I don't know who that's for, but is even anything a little bit shady, don't jump into it. But at the same time, at the same time, until you know all the facts, until everything's been illuminated for you, try to maintain a positive attitude about it. Don't go into a situation and be like, yeah, I'm not doing this because it's just going to go the same way it did last time. Don't do that to yourself. You have to maintain a positive attitude until everything's been illuminated for you. So, until you're 100% sure, don't jump. And sometimes the advice has absolutely nothing to do with any of the rest of the cards. <clears throat> Knight of Pentacles reversed and the tower. Okay. Two 
don't shoot down an offer because you're afraid of another tower. Is that what I just said? <laughs> pretty sure that's pretty much what I just said. Karma and the moon reversed again. I'm hearing in due time, fire signs in due time. You're not supposed to have all the answers yet. The universe has more in store for you. Really? Hit me again, the sun reversed in the empress. You have to let the sun shine in your life if you expect anything to grow. It's not always going to be a tower moment, fire signs. It's not always going to be a disaster. You have to trust yourself and you have to trust the universe. Pretty much is what that boils down to. Let me know what happens. Because <clears throat> now I'm curious. Alright, let's... Sometimes they go quick. Sometimes it's like pulling teeth. To make sure I get the right cards in the right pile here. All right. Earth signs. Heavenly Father, Mother of the Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for... Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Summon and Rising Venus, January 23rd and 24th, source thank you spirit four of wands reversed two of pentacles reversed oh my waters get a little choppy doors go a slamming towers went a fallen What happened? Queen of Cups upright, Five of Swords upright. Um, I'm feeling someone exercised a little bit of healthy selfishness. I don't know if it was you or them. But whoever it was, I don't think the other person was too happy about it by the looks of that. Happened after that. The Hierophant and the Six of Swords reversed. Well, that's a heck of a time to come back, isn't it? I don't know whose story I'm reading right now, but this is getting good. Just saying. It's happening this weekend. The Nine of Wands and the Queen of Wands reversed. Okay. 
Okay. Heavenly Father, Mother of the Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for my Earth sign friends, please? Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 23rd, 24th, 2021. Thank you, Source. Thank you, Spirit. Um... Queen of Pentacles, yeah. I don't think somebody treated you very well as sign friends because uh, that Queen of Pentacles is saying you put yourself first. Queen of Pentacles says, you will acknowledge me for the catch that I am. And if you don't, bye. Because I got plenty of my own Pentacles. I don't need yours. And, well, there's plenty of folks out there who want this Pentacle, obviously, more than you do. That, that's what that says to me right now. Why is the Queen of Cups here? King of Swords. Why is the Five of Swords here? Four Pentacles reversed. That says to me, you know, I, I still hold a cup for you. I still have very deep emotion for you, but this isn't working. Let's be honest with ourselves. Out you go. Probably a harsh exchange of words. Probably a separation. Letting each other go. Okay. After that. Why is the Hierophant here? Because this is the one that raised my eyebrows. Why is the Hierophant here? Six cups reversed. Hmm. One more. Four of Wands upright. Celebration, gaiety. Stability. Why is the Six of Cups reversed here? Oh, wow. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Ten of Wands. Ace of Cups. You let it go, you released it, you moved on, you started filling your own cup. There was bad blood up here. Bad blood up here. Somebody was not happy. I think you may have moved on. Like, to a point of moved to some of you were engaged. Like, somebody's getting married. <laughs> or it got real serious, and then... Why is the Six of Swords reversed here? Let's 
Justice reversed. Oh, that's not fair. <clears throat> Wait a minute, how can you move on so quickly? Oh my. That tips some scales in an awkward direction, doesn't it? Why is it nine of wands here for what's coming in this weekend? Oh, I'm just throwing down cards. Don't look at me, it's not my journey. Seven of Wands reversed. Why is Seven of Wands reversed? Cups. I still hold a cup for you. Someone wanting one last try, one last push. I still hold a cup for you. I take back everything I said. This is what I'm hearing right now. I take back everything I said. And... Why the seven of wands? Strength. I accept our differences. Courage. Wow. Someone's finally going to acknowledge you for the catch that they let go. You're the one that got away, Earth Signs, and they're going to try to snag you back up this weekend. I don't think you're going for it, though. Why is the Queen of Wands reversed here? in the back of wands reverse. You're like, nope, you know what? Um, this is my wand. <laughs> this is my new journey. This is my new start that does not include you. I'm happy. I'm in a connection where I'm happy. And I'm not into your games. Earth signs. Proud of you. <laughs> Just saying. I'm proud of you. But it's your journey. Do what you want. If you want to flat out reject it, do it. If you want to go back to it, do it, do what you want. It's not my journey. But if somebody did you wrong, I mean, let's get your advice. The Alchemist and the Nine of Swords. Star reversed, Eight of Swords reversed. Don't lose sleep over this. And cause yourself to go right back where you were again. 
don't allow this to put you in that mental cage that so many of us go into when something like this occurs and don't let this disrupt your healing process. Okay, manifest the future that you want. And if it's too little too late for them, it's too little too late for them. Wool reversed, Ace of Swords. If there is truly unfinished business, okay. If you don't think the cycle is over, fine. But if the cycle is over, don't make it unover. Two of Wands, death. Does that make sense? Let go of the wand of the past, move forward toward the future, and allow for change. Okay? allow for something to end for something new to be reborn if that makes any sense to anybody okay i gotta go to bed gang i have to get up very early in the morning to go to the bread and butter job lots to do over the weekend you guys should start hearing from me tomorrow night for the february readings oh my gosh really wow 2021 is already flying by. Woo! Okay. So we can get the February readings up by the 31st. That is the new goal. We'll see what happens. I'm feeling pretty good right now, but I think this is my third wind for the day. Like I said, um, weekends just exhaust me. So if anything, you will hear from me Sunday night or Monday for the work week top and bottom of the deck. But you guys take care. Thanks for stopping by. Love ya. Be blessed, be safe, be kind, be true, and I will talk to you later.